I'm Phil Lemper with the new product Tits and Misses. Up first, it's Straw Propeller Natural Gourmet Oatmeal Blueberry Blitz. If you're looking for the ultimate convenience in preparing oatmeal that practically tastes like candy, this is it. Just add a half to two thirds of a cup of boiling water and let it sit in this container for two to three minutes. Stir it up and you're ready to eat. This recipe includes both yogurt coated blueberries, you can see them right through here, and uncoated ones. Most of the yogurt coating actually dissolved throughout the oatmeal when it was heated. One container is 340 calories, 11 grams of fat, and a whopping 18 grams of sugars. Not all of which comes from the blueberries, by the way, but from the added sugars as well. Now the good news is that the container contains 9 grams of dietary fiber and just 108 milligrams of sodium. Retails for 275 to 350. For four ounces, total score is 76. Die for Telly Truly Tomatoes Rustic Cut, it's a hit. These tomatoes are perfect to use in recipes that have either chicken, fish, or meat that will absorb the extra tomato juice. The flavor is true tomato and does taste very fresh. You'll think that the consistency is a little too thin, but cooking with it adds a great flavor. While there is a little sea salt added, you'll have to add your own garlic and other seasonings. Half a cup, just 30 calories, but does have 260 milligrams of sodium. As compared to other chopped, sliced, diced, or crushed canned tomatoes, this one is slightly higher in sodium. Be sure to compare the price of this package to canned tomatoes. It is higher. Retails for $349 to $399 for 26.46 ounces. Total score is 85. Up next, it's General Mills' return to the fruit brute artificial cherry flavor frosted cereal with spooky fun marshmallows. And it's actually a hit. Marshmallows are in cereal are back in a big way, and so is this limited edition of five different flavors of spooky cereals. This one is the cherry flavor. You can tell by the red. Surprisingly, the taste is not overly sweet, and it only has 9 grams of sugars per cup. And the average kid's cereal has 12 grams. More surprisingly, the cereal is made from whole grain corn and corn meal. However, it's not gluten free, as it may contain wheat ingredients. Now, this could have been the perfect kid cereal if they just had chosen to avoid the artificial colors and flavors. Retails for $250 to $299 for 9.6 ounces. Total score is 85. Sea Point Farms Crunchy Coated Premium Black Edamame Sea Salt, it's a hit. Now, I had never tasted black edamame before. In fact, I never even heard of black edamame. It has a sweeter flavor and, of course, is black in color. These beans are lightly coated with cornstarch, coconut oil, sugar, and sea salt, and are very crunchy and delicious. Quarter cup, less than a third of this package, is just 140 calories, 4.5 grams of fat, and 9 grams of protein. This is definitely a snack to consider and makes you a trendsetter. Retails for $1.99 for 3.5 ounces. Total score is 90. Amy's Andy Dandy Candy Crisp Flavor is our hit of the week. Now here's another winner from Amy's. I've been tasting their products for a long time, and I have a lot of respect for this company. We've gotten to know the taste preferences of Rachel, Amy's mom, then Amy when she graduated college and joined the biz, now Andy, Amy's dad and Rachel's husband. His taste buds, frankly, are terrific. This chocolate bar, which comes in two pieces, has a great recipe of rice crisps, almonds, caramel, and chocolate. You won't be disappointed. Of course, the chocolate is dark chocolate. However, I would like to see the percent of cacao listed on the package. One of the bars, which is three quarters of an ounce, is just 100 calories, and it's gluten free. Retails for $249 for one and a half ounces. Total score is 91. Next week's products are Cherry Man Maraschinos, Revolution Foods Cheese Pizza, Phillips Gourmet Portobello Mushrooms, Mama Chia Vitality Snack, and Belinsky's Chicken Meatballs. Check out supermarketguru.com every Wednesday for our new product hits and misses.